Hello YouTube, welcome to Annoying Fisco's channel. This is the game Aegis Wings. Aegis Wings, sorry. And now today I'm going to be playing on... I'm just going to be showing you like basic things. So create a match, normal difficulty, creating game. This is Aegis Wings. This game is free. You can download it for free online on the game, arcade, um, on the game uh, marketplace. It's free, like I said before. It's only literally it takes like a minute to download. You can play this game with your friends and like whatever. It's multiplayer. Um, you can play on a few difficulties. You can play on all right, only two difficulties actually. You can play on normal and um, insane. Now on normal you have you have a you have a few number of lives, but on insane you only have one life, which is pretty hard to live with because yeah. And when you're doing it alone, it's even harder. And uh, also, when you're playing this game, you get like you can get achievements for it, which is pretty cool because it's free. When you're playing, you can get things such as power ups. So this little purple ball that I have, well, had on, that was a power up. And um, when I do, when I shot that, that was a power up. I'm just pressing. See these little things that are floating from the kills that I get? These are power ups. So. You just get it, and it'll give me something. You can you can collect either the same number of power ups. So that is a different power up from this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and waste this because it's gonna just either it's gonna switch or it's just gonna let me. Yeah, so I'm just gonna waste it again. I might as well since I'm gonna get a new power up. But if they're the same power ups, you can just keep stacking them more and more and more. But I highly don't suggest that. I just just you just get it, um, the power up by yourself. And, um, oh, so this is the boss. So in like every game, there is a boss. So here I'm gonna use my um, power up by pressing B. And now if this boss hits me by with himself, then I will I will receive damage and die. And um, here, so let's kill these things. These little minions. Oh, see the same power up, so it's stacked up. I'm gonna use it now because he just shoots these. Now, obviously, as you gain levels, it gets harder. Like I said, this game is free. It's actually, it's really fun, and it's pretty addicting. Because, considering the fact that it's free, it's a pretty decent game. Since there aren't that many free games on the marketplace, there are only, I think, two. Oh, somebody wants to play Modern Warfare with me. Oh, oops, got distracted by that. That's okay. So, I'm just going to go ahead and kill this boss. Oh, these are his little minions here. Um, get that. Oh, oops, that was a little bit of voice. So that that power up absorbs the bullets so they don't reach me. Which is cool, nice, whatever. Oh, Jesus, I'm dying. I'm doing terrible, but whatever. So yeah, um, oh, here's a power up. It's actually very useful when I'm fighting this boss. Oh, and he died cool see now that level took me three minutes literally not even and that's my total score now, like I said before this game is free and you can play online you could change your color here um, you can invite your friends to join so if you have any friends I'll play this game or you just ask them to download it so here there you go this guy has the game one of my friends here Oh, and look at that, he's in my game. Okay, so we're going to play together. Look at that. We can. You can also join up in this game. So you can act as a pair of two. And that's really cool. Because if you get a, a pair of four, not only you'll get an achievement. If you get four people to join your game, you'll get an achievement. And um, you do, when you use your power-ups, you they, um, they're a lot more powerful. But the only negative side is, is that when you're paired up, you have you do move slower because you obviously way more and yeah it slows you down but yeah that's okay so um the basic basically this really it's not it's a pretty decent game i enjoy it and um if really if you don't really have any games that you can play i highly suggest you download this game because it's really fun and it it does get boring but that's after you literally you've beaten it on insane, gotten all the achievements. See now I'm playing with my friend right now. We're we're actually pretty we're, we're okay. See now the power up is twice as powerful as it was before. 
so it's much more efficient and effective. Now I just use my power up because he gave me it, and yeah. So this is cool. So we're just playing together. I use my power up, so now we're a big bubble together. We both share the power up basically, so we're both gonna get the XP for it. Um, and yeah. So yeah, we just use it at the same time. We just wasted our power ups, but that's okay. And also, when I'm attached to him, I can shoot in different directions. So like, I'm the blue one. If you could see my shots are going all over the place, that's because I can aim though. But when you're playing regularly, you don't, you can't really aim it, which sucks. So yeah, now it would have been. It's a good idea to attach and use the power up, and then you could just detach. You can use your teammate sort of as an aid if you really want, and you can just assist him at times when you see that he's low on HP. With the little blue bar at the top left of my screen, you could see how much HP I have, and at the bottom left, you could see how much HP he has. So yeah, it's very. It's this team. This this game does involve teamwork and communication between others. So. It's suggested if you're playing with somebody else that you have a mic because some people don't really, common sense doesn't really come into hand when you're playing this game. So if people might think like um, not connecting is a better choice than connecting, they're obviously wrong because the only way you're going to beat some levels, such as insane, you're only going to be able to beat that if you connect because if you go solo, then definitely you're going to lose a lot quicker. Now you don't want to betray your teammates, you don't want to get all of the power up so that they don't get any because not only is that not going to get them anything, they're going to get pissed off at you and they're going to leave. I don't, you could do that, it's, not, it's, it's your choice, it's really not mine, but it's a bad suggestion. So yeah, see, he connected to me. You can always disconnect them if they're really, if they're just using you, you can just press X again and it'll just disconnect. But like I said, it's it's a good game, it's free. If, if you have space, if you have an arcade, I don't suggest you get this game because your arcade really can't handle this. But if you do have a pro or a leader or whatever, you're the new system, the new Xbox that came out, then yes, I highly do suggest you get this game because it's really good and it's free. So why not? If you really don't, if you don't like it, you can just delete it since it doesn't make it really that much of a difference. So yeah, he's attached to me, so I can't shoot randomly, but he can. He can just aim wherever he wants. Oh, I just killed him. I would apologize to him if I had the mic on, but I don't. I'm gonna just... Yeah, okay, I'll attach to him. Oh, he's gonna get me killed now. See, now you have to... Usually, when you're playing this, you might... It's recommended that you get your friends instead to play with you instead of random strangers because other randoms like sometimes they'll listen to you but majority of the time the people are just negative and they just they want to do whatever helps them not really you so it could be useful but it's not really that suggested It's not suggested that you play with randoms because they might be ignorant and not listen to you. They might think what they're saying is better. I know that that's happened to me so many times. It's just annoying. But yeah, I've got I've gotten a lot of the achievements for this game. Now, okay, um, I'm gonna have to stop recording now because I only have I can only post a video that's 10 minutes long. I don't know why, but I just can't have another minute to record. But I'm gonna stop 30 seconds. Okay, so once again, yeah, the game is over. This is our score since there are two people. That's our score. And now I'm just going to quickly go through the achievements for this game before time runs out. Um, I got, so I have 5 out of 10. There are 10 achievements. Okay, so I have Form of 4 Shift. So that's what I was talking about on online for the Form 1. Complete the game on Normal. There are two difficulties, like I said, in Normal and Extreme or Insane. Earn uh, 100,000 points. Each level you play, you get points. Every single thing you kill, you get a point. Um, finish mission three on any difficulty. So there are missions. Level, mission one, two, three, four. Yeah, and goes. Uh, earn thirty thousand points. Obviously, if I got a th hundred thousand, I would have got that. I still didn't get one hundred eighty-five thousand. Destroy all enemies in a level. Complete a level. Complete a level on insane. Taking no damage. Earn ten thousand. Okay. Anyway, thanks for watching my video. I gotta end it now because time's running out. And uh, remember, rate, comment, and tell me 
send me your videos. Okay, bye guys.